What's up everyone, it's Viktor Gichan and welcome to the Contributors channel. Today we're talking about artificial intelligence from Google. Seven months ago, OpenAI introduced the first publicly available AI called ChatGPT, which had reached 1 million users just within five days. On February 6, 2023, Google opened for the public their artificial intelligence called BART. And today, just two months later, more than 100 million users already using BART daily. Let's dive in and compare BART and ChatGPT to see which AI is smarter and faster and what are the main differences between them. Bard and ChatGPT are two artificial intelligence that can generate text, translate languages, write different kinds of creative content, and answer your questions in an informative way. So which one is better? Let's find out. One of the biggest advantages of Bard is that Bard is connected to the internet. This means that Bard can access the latest information available online, which is a huge advantage over ChatGPT which is only trained on data up to 2021. For example, if you ask Bart what is the price of Bitcoin, Bart will be able to tell you the actual price. But if you ask ChatGPT the same question, it will tell you the price that was in October 2021. This is just one example of how Bart's connection to the internet gives it huge advantage over ChatGPT. For another example, let's ask boss Bart in ChatGPT, give me shortest and cheapest flight from San Francisco, California to London, UK and see what we'll get. So this is the response from Bart. The shortest and cheapest flight from San Francisco to London, UK, direct flight. It gives you the airline, it gives you time, how many hours and the cost, $175. And it gives you all information, including flight number. Let's ask the same question from ChatGPT to see what we get from ChatGPT. See, and it says that I'm sorry, but as an AI language model, I don't have real time access to current flight prices or schedules. However, I can suggest, and this is just suggestion. So it's kind of creative things, but not actual information that you need. What makes Bard more powerful is the integration with Google Flights, YouTube, Search, and other Google services in real time. To provide you with this answer, Bard integrated a lot of different different data sets like flight data and transport data. It's super powerful and super impressive. And it provides the answer much faster than ChatGPT. Let's ask both Bard and ChatGPT. Give me top 10 most popular YouTube videos on how to start and grow a business, invest, create passive income and build wealth that would perfectly fit the contributors YouTube channel and see what we will get. So this is a response from Bard. Here's the top 10 most popular YouTube videos on how to start and grow a business invest. And this is the videos, how to start a business with no money and who created these videos. And these videos are all highly informative and provide valuable insights. And then even short description about each video, what is this about? So you can have understanding before you watch. So let's see what we would we get from ChatGPT. It gives you just a list of 10 and remember, right? So if you remember, since ChatGPT doesn't have access to the real data, it these videos were popular, the most popular in 2021. Before we show you how Bart can help you make investment decisions, if you like this video and want to watch more videos like this, subscribe, like, share and hit the bell below to be notified about our new videos. Thank you. Let's ask Bard and ChatGPT to pick the stocks we should invest in. Please give me a list of 10 stocks of companies with positive EPS earning per share with intrinsic value. Use the formula to calculate intrinsic value at least 40% higher than the current price and that pay dividend with 10% or more 
in your annual yield, give a short description of which company. Let's see what we would get from Bart. And here you go. This is the table was created by Bart within a couple of seconds. See the history and he created a table, not just a list. Table on the left column we have the names and then there is a earnings per share and the price per equity and uh, intrinsic value and dividend yield. And he picked the stocks mini with minimum dividend yield is 6.8% uh, and the maximum 10.3%. Wow, that's amazing. And this is so convenient. Just imagine how much time it would take you to do this research and find those companies. So let's see what result we would get from chat GPT. So here is the chat GPT. We put the same question. Please give us a list of 10 stocks of companies with positive earning per share with intrinsic value at least 40% higher than the current price and the paid dividend with 10% or more annual yield and give a short description of each company. See what we were going to get and look at the difference so if you can see chat gpt first of all excuses as an ai language model i don't have access to real-time financial data and can't provide personalized investment advice however i can give you some general guidance and this is just give you some guidance and then it gives you some stocks and if you look at the stocks you can see it's like 7.3 percent but then it's like 4.3 percent 2.6 percent so it even doesn't give you 1.7 percent even though the request was give me at least 10 percent so this is like way way far from what we need and you understand this information again on 2021 would you use chat gpt for this type of requests i don't think so so which one is better bart or chat gpt it depends on what are you looking for if you need a large language model with a wide range of knowledge and the ability to follow instructions and get connected to the real data then bart is the better choice if you need a larger language model that is more creative and concise then chat gpt is the better choice and one more thing which makes bart more convenient to use bart you don't need to log in unlike with ChatGPT. Just go to Bart, B -A -R -D, dot Google, dot com and ask your question. That's all for today. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to subscribe and hit the bell below to be notified about new videos. And don't forget to leave a comment below with your thoughts on Bart and ChatGPT. Stay healthy, stay wealthy, stay tuned.